Dad? Dad? Are you there? Can you hear me? this place it's a school I attended before judgment day why are we here <sighs> you know why dad it doesn't matter oh, come on it's your birthday of course it matters besides you're the one always saying that you're old enough to scavenge well today you actually are but we're not even supposed to be here the resistance said Skynet was around here I wouldn't take everything John Connor says as gospel what do you have against him? He used to be a real asshole. We went to school together. This school, actually. You've met John Connor? I didn't know him personally, but everybody knew about him. I guess this was just one of the schools he got expelled from. I doubt he'd remember it. Okay, it looks safe. You can follow me. You're already on your way here, aren't you? I don't need you to babysit me, Dad. Just get yourself over here. I need your help. Are you a good student? Uh, yeah, not particularly. Why am I not surprised? Watch it. <clears throat> hey, Dad. I found some chemicals. You have to dream bigger, kid. Especially today. I'm still taking them. There you are. Now, let's start searching this place. What are we even looking for? A time capsule. What's a time capsule? Well, it's a, a box filled with letters, pictures, and other things that we buried when I was a student here. Why did you bury it? To preserve a piece of our lives, I guess. Since it's been in the ground this whole time, I'm hoping that it survived Judgment Day. If I'd known that the world would end just a couple of years later, I would have hidden something more useful in there. And again, no one could have predicted that. What would you have hidden? I don't know. A beer or something?
here lies history. I think I found it. Stand back. You know, back in my day, parents used to say that they wanted to give their children more than they had growing up. And since that won't be possible for you, I'd like you to have at least a taste of what I had. Okay, let's see what we've got. Uh, you're something? Really? A machine? Yeah. We've got enough of those around here, don't we? <laughs> Okay, what else is in there? Some baseball cards, a cassette tape. Dad, I, I think we should go. I really don't need anything. Uh, okay, how about this? Huh. I, I know it's not much. Happy birthday, Jacob. That's cool. Thanks, Dad. Ah, oh, look at this. That's a letter I wrote to myself. What does it say? Uh, future Frank. That's me. If you don't teach your son to mind his own business, I'm going to be very disappointed with you. Ha ha, very funny. <laughs> I'll hang on to it for later. Fine, let's just go. It's not safe here. Wait, there's something else here. Well, this one says that it needs to be hand-delivered. Oh, let's see what's so important. Dad, we don't have time for this, and it's not for you. I doubt anyone's waiting for it. How would you like it if a stranger read your letter? Are you serious? I'm just trying to follow your rules. You know what? It's your birthday. I won't open it unless we find the proper recipient. It'll be our little project. I promise. What? Come here. Stay low. As soon as it comes closer, we make a run for it, right? Now go! Come on, Jacob! Stay close! I'm right behind you! Through here!
don't sound too good. Don't worry about me. Get out of here. Understand? But Dad... I said get out of here. Get down into the sewers. I'll meet you there soon. Dad? Safe. Do you hear me? 
If you can hear me, please let me know. Where are you? Jake! You're, you're hurt. They're coming. We need to go. We're gonna be all right. Come on. Back! Move back! Dad! Jacob, run! <laughs> ah!